We all have a lot of work to get done every day, and whether you're sitting or standing, it can take a toll on your body. Joining us today is the fitness nomad, John Ashworth, to share five exercises, and hopefully we'll get to one nutritional tip to help you get through the day. And this topic came about when you were actually out at the Law Memorial dedication today. Right, and I saw a lot of people standing around for a long period of time, and I thought, you know, we should come up with something tonight for the people who are standing around or doing a lot of sitting all day. I was doing a lot of sitting today. Because so. you can feel it in your body. So right. if you do some moves, right. how does that actually um, positively impact you? Well, one of the first things it does is that it just starts increasing circulation. So you start to deliver fresh oxygen to parts of your body that are not getting it when you're sitting. So that's, that's the big one. And then the second thing is, of course, it just gets you up and moving out of your chair, new scenery, et cetera. Okay, so you have five moves right. to share with us. Right. And you actually have been doing these in a sequence. So we have a right. graphic. We're going to bring that up for you. And the first one is the forward bend. First one is the forward bend. And I got to tell you, I did these earlier. And the forward bend is your feet shoulder width apart. And you're bending forward with a nice neutral back. You got that normal curve in your low back. And then you kind of let everything fall down, tuck your chin into your chest. And who cares what people think when they see you doing it because it's going right. to just really you make just you feel better. Now you can do the same thing with your so, hand in the air. Same thing. So you go down into that forward bend. I don't know which camera we're on here. We go down into that forward bend. You put one hand on the ground and then you reach the other hand up. You take a nice big breath in there and you're going to get a nice big expansion in your thoracic cavity. It's going to help your breathing and again deliver more fresh oxygen to the body. Okay, next one. Is back extension? Back extension. This is a really good one. You got to make sure you tighten your your glutes because you got to tighten your butt when you do this one to protect your low back. But anything where you go backward like this is super energizing to the body, to the and just so to your physiology. so easy to do. So easy yeah. to do, and you can do it with your hands there, hands there. Next one, you say palms together, out and up with a side bend. But right, so you gotta watch it. Don't okay. read it because it's easier to see than 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 to read. And so you you put your hands together, interlace your fingers, you push your hands out and up. And then you do this without your shirt coming up so you're not showing everybody your belly here. Yeah, don't and flash. And you go over. Okay, really quickly, Head last over. one because we're 10 <laughs> seconds. Feet on the wall. All right, feet on the wall. Okay, so you go down, you get down on the floor, make Lou do his job here, and then you get those feet up and you just lay here like this. Five minutes like this at 2 o'clock instead of a Diet Coke and you'll be good to go. And I know the nutritional advice is to eat more meals a day that are smaller, drink a lot of water. That's right. If you'd like to read John's blog on how to just improve your work day through fitness, log on to our web channel and click on news links. John, thanks. All right. Carleen. John and Lee, thank